Hello and welcome to Monday Night Raw. And right now, before the show starts, we've got Edge versus Roman Reigns for the warm-up match for Triple H versus Roman Reigns you know at Elimination Chamber. Raw is brought to you by Elimination Chamber. And this match starts right now. Hello and welcome to Monday Night Raw. And the rated R Superstar. Remember, Edge is the WWE Champion. And he wants to face Roman to prove he's a real champion. So tonight, it's Edge versus Roman on the big night field of Monday Night Raw. We've got a different Edge now. Obviously Edge de de got defeated by Seth Rollins, but look, He's transformed into a new man. And he's ready for a fight. Tonight on Raw. I wonder what Roman's thinking. We've got a new edge, we've got everything. And he said, Edge said he wants to be in the Elimination Chamber match, but they are refusing his request. General Manager is clearly not impressed with Edge's actions. Saying that he wants to be in the match, but that's going to waste chances for all the stars in that match. The dark side of Edge has embraced the entire Raw Stadium. He is about to go ham on Roman Reigns. And here is the reigning WWE. Universal Champion, the Tribal Chief, the head of the table, Roman Reigns. He is absolutely dominant. 760 days as Universal Champion. I've just got word that whoever wins tonight goes in the Universal Championship Elimination Chamber match. Oh, that is news for all of us there. Roman probably wants to be in that match. What Edge is thinking right now, why didn't I get in the match? Why was I refused? Well, this jackass was accepted into the match. Well, anyway, Roman looks confident as ever. He is gonna smash everyone in his way. But Edge, don't underestimate the power, the darkness, the enthusiasm, the agility of the rated R superstar. Edge as we get started into this match. Both men are looking ready for a fight. And the bell is rung. And Roman. Oh, Edge. Edge taking Roman into the corner now. Oh, and laying the blows to the leg of Roman Reigns. Remember, don't underestimate him. Like I said before, this man is unstoppable sometimes. 
he has done the most craziest things imaginable. Spear Jeff Hardy from a freaking, while he was hanging off the damn title, he jumped from a ladder and speared him down. We've got the new Brood Edge now. So Roman sees Edge as a stepping stone. But this is not someone to take as a step and stuff. DDT by the head of the table. Roman Reigns. Roman's got his moveset all sorted out for tonight. And oh my god, just ground and pound by Roman Reigns. He's very good at manipulating your opponent as well. As well as manipulate them when talking. Remember when Roman was talking to Jimmy? He manipulated him. He's very good at doing that. Oh my god, he wants to break Edge's hand. He wants to make sure Edge does not even hit one spear. Because he's stomping on the arm and the hand and the wrist at the same time. Oh my god, Edge laying the headbutts in now. The crazy, unearthly Edge. He is not from this planet. He is vicious and Roman raids. Hanging him up on the ropes. Oh my god. God, he landed hard there. And a kick by Edge. Getting him up now. And now a kick to the back of Roman. And now, looking for a submission. Looking for a submission of Roman. Will he tap out? Roman's in trouble. Roman's in trouble. Grabbing him by the throat. But Roman, with the quickness, his submission defense for a nice punch by Edge. And Edge has been taking it to Roman. Hook in the leg. Very cocky from Edge there. But I think that's a rope. Yep, rope break by Edge. Roman got his foot on the rope. And here comes Edge. Fired up. Edge is back, ladies and gentlemen. And an implant DDT. And oh my god. Roman could be out cold here. Shoot stop. Well, that be it. Roman's going to lose. Roman's going to... Oh, Edge gets, gets... Gets a bit too ahead of himself. Roman got the kick out. And now the educator. The educator by Edge. Submission locked in. Will this be it for Roman? Will this be his first loss? No. Roman gets out of it. Roman lifting him up now. Superman punch, no. What the hell just happened there? Oh, went for the cravat sleeper. Gets caught. Roman with the nice elbows. Two edges. Gut area. And now Edge gets Roman caught. Went for the cravat again. Big punch to Reigns. A punch misses. And Roman looking for a nice power bomb to Edge. Oh no! Oh God! God damn! A power bomb! Edge is out cold. Oh my God! And oh God! It's the announce table. And now Roman looking to pick up Edge onto the apron. Oh! God, face first. Can Edge get back into this? Spear! And we're back, ladies and gentlemen. And Roman's got Edge in the ring. Nice ground and pound. They've been going at it on the outside. And it's been crazy. Another submission. Roman may tap out tonight. The first loss of Roman's career. Roman is reeling. Oh, wait a minute. Reigns getting out of it. Big punches by Edge. Spinning heel kick. First loss, first loss. Roman, if he loses tonight, what's Triple H going to think? He's going to have the advantage over Roman Reigns. And now Edge going for the head of Roman. And now a nice snap me to Roman Reigns. Edge has been going crazy on Roman, but Roman gets ca catches him in the leg. Guillotine, no, Guillotine misses. Gets him in the jaw. Superman punch misses. Superman punch connects. Cover to Edge, that's a rope break. Edge got to the ropes this time. That's big. Guillotine, Guillotine by Roman Reigns, the Universal Champion. And Roman Reigns defeats the reigning R superstar. Edge is probably fuming as we get into our next match. Congratulations, Roman Reigns. And we're back in. Wait a minute.
The hell is Happy Corbin doing out here? Bum ass Corbin. That's what we call him around here. Look how idiotic this man is. Why, why is he here? Like, I don't want him. What does he even want? Why is he? Oh, uh, call from the general manager. Happy Corbin is here because he demanded a match tonight, but he does not know who's facing. And whoever wins, ends the WWE Championship Elimination Chamber. Right. Who's that gonna be then? Well, I guess we'll find out. Hey, why can't this guy be I don't know why Corbin wants a match. Happy Corbin has I know the end of days is unstoppable, but we don't even know who it could be. It could be anybody. We don't know. We've just had one outstanding match. And now we have this bum ass Corbin. Who is it gonna be? Come on. This better be somebody that'll beat him up. Because I've had enough of bum ass Corbin. Oh my god! Brock Lesnar! Oh god, Corbin, get out the damn ring! The beast has been unleashed! A Monday Night Raw! Oh my god! But Baron probably didn't even realize. Happy bum ass Corbin decided, you know what? I want a match. Well, he must be regretting it now. Because Barack Lesnar is here. Barack is looking ready as ever to beat somebody up. He's already beat many opponents before. Stalking Happy Corbin around the ring with a smirk on his face. Giving him a little smile on the way around. Happy Corbin. I, I can see what he's seeing right now. He is seeing blood. He is seeing a beast. But you know what the beast sees? His deer that he hunts every day on the farm. He's the hog slaughterer, as they said on SmackDown. Breaking the fourth wall a bit, but on SmackDown in real life. This is gonna be a big one. This is gonna be a squash. Uh, Corbin, uh, are you sure about this, buddy? I don't know if he can hear me. Are you sure about this? Are you sure? Oh God, Brock Lesnar delivering the knees, and oh my God, Corbin signed up for a beatdown and just launching him across the ring. Corbin has not realised what he's got himself in for. Oh God, again, the beast. God. Going for the leg. Oh my god, and now a kick to the back. At least Edge put up a fight. Corbin's not done anything. Oh god, stop to the arm. And now Corbin gets caught with punches. Oh my god, look at the beast. Look at him. Corbin's done nothing this entire match. And it's just started. Oh my god. Look at Brock. He's already bleeding. He is already bleeding. Oh my god, he's looking to tap out Corbin already. With a nice leg bar slash arm bar. Oh my god. Oh my god, Corbin. Oh! Corbin has got good submission defense. Give him that. But Brock again. F5, F5. No. Corbin evades the F5 for once getting something done in this match. And Corbin plus Brock! Oh God, Brock may lose. Brock's just got man hand. Never mind. I was wrong. No, wait. Am I wrong? F5? I thought he was going to go for the F5 of his own, but no. Is he going to bust open Brock? No. He can't do it. And a kick to the gut now. Brock is two on. Like, he's two. What's the word? Two like act 
massive on Corbin. One, two. Kicked out by Corbin. Lord, scarily close to three. One. And Brock went for the F5. Brock went for the F5. But Corbin. Big. Oh, that knocks him out. That knocks Brock out. Corbin. Punch. F5. That's it. Match over. It is over. F5. Cover one. Will that be it? What? Corbin. Gets the shoulder up. Well, he went for Suplex City, but Brock yeah, gets evaded. I can't believe Corbin is surviving. Point. How is he attack. reeling? How is he doing this? Oh and now Corbin, backbreaker! Oh my God, Brock in trouble, choke slam! But Brock with a nice little counter to Corbin. And now tossing him like a ragdoll again. Oh God, ground and pound to Corbin, busting him open even more. And I think Corbin uh, should leave the arena at this point. We're going for the leg of Brock, smart move. If Corbin gets that end of days, nobody's kicked out of it, except for Drew McIntyre, but that's it. That's the only person that's kicked out, God! Got him, Corbin, end of days, end of days! That's the match! Kicking out of the end of days. I thought it was over. Corbin going up. Nay! Oh my god, that could be it. That could be it. That Brock could be. Brock could be out. Shoulder. Shoulder. God, he's got it. He's got it. He's got it. He's got it. Will that be it? Nope. Brock completely demolishes. The leg. Of Corbin and all. Welcome to Suplex City, bitch. Oh my god. Corbin may have just found himself in a predicament. That's gotta be it. Suplex City. Good night. One. Come on. What? Another kick out. Corbin is resilient tonight. Corbin is dead resilient. And F5. Wait a minute. Brock doesn't realize it. He's too close to the ropes. Corbin on the ropes. Rope break. Brock Lesnar. Brock Lesnar must be fuming. And now Brock. Now laying in the elbows, punches, whatever. Former UFC champion is going to town on Happy Corbin. Can Brock pull this one off? God! Remember, the start of the match. Let's just give some credit to Corbin here. How is he surviving? You saw at the start of the match, oh my god, choking up. You saw at the start of the match. Corbin was literally struggling! Oh my god! Corbin could not get one signature in on Brock Lesnar. But yeah, he was struggling at the start of the match, and Brock was dominating the entire match. We're in F5. Wait, no. Oh no! Oh no! Power bomb! Corbin floor. somehow pulled off, nearly pulled off an upset with that end of days. Imagine Corbin beating He's Roman Reigns or Edge for a WWE title. I can't imagine it. What an idiotic song. Right, yeah, let's get him up. Let's get him up, Brock. Come on, oh no. God! Brock should have got him up then. Should have knocked some sense in. To him. He should have got him up on his shoulders. F5. Get in the ring. Pin. Sorry, Brock, if you can hear me. Well, that was a stupid move. Okay, okay. And Brock Lesnar into the barricade goes Corbin. He hit hard into that barricade. Corbin actually is getting off. But Brock is not done with Corbin. He wants him back into the ring immediately. He's not waiting for any. Dallying around on the outside, and now suplex. Yeah, it's over. Right, should I even bother to commentate this? Like Corbin is not done anything. I'm enjoying it. I shouldn't even be commentating. I should just be enjoying the moment. 
Corbin's done. Suplex City. Good night. Baron Corbin. He's going to the Cover. That's it. Corbin is out. Congrats. Brock Lesnar. The Beast. Could he be the next WWE Here Champion? Congrats to Brock. We move in to our next Lesnar. match. Oh, we know who this is. The Judgment Day. And he's got his boys with him. Priest. And Rhea Ripley. Making his way to the ring. Accompanied by Edge and Rhea. Damien Priest. The Judgment Day. So Priest is actually fighting tonight. Will he get a win to save the Judgment Day from losing? I don't know if it's going to be possible. But he's got a big challenger ahead of him. And that man is Dolph Ziggler. His debut to Monday Night Raw. And Universe Mode in general. Will he do it? Will he come out on top? Find out next on Raw. And we're back. On Monday Night Raw, as Dolph Ziggler makes his way to the ring. This man can be dangerous. Because he almost beat, nah, I would not say almost beat. He put up a fight against Goldberg. So I think he'll be able to take on some Damian Priest, if you know what I mean. Ziggler. Looks ready as ever. As his debut on Universe Mode better be good. If he loses this, then he's just gonna be a lacking stock. Let's just say that. He needs to show why he's here on my Universe Mode to prove he is worthy of a WWE title. Here we go. Getting into the match. Damian Priest versus Dolph Ziggler. And Ziggler going in for the action. And Priest grabbing Ziggler into the corner. And now Priest unloading on Dolph. Oh my God. Jesus. Priest gets kicked to the gut. The Judgment Day on the outside watching the match as it goes on. And now into the corner. God, look at this big elbow to Ziggler. It's not looking good already for Dolph Ziggler because Priest all went for a spear. Big elbow by Ziggler. And now trying to fight back, but Priest just keeps getting more offense on Ziggler in a backbreaker. Remember, Ziggler has been a Intercontinental Champion, a World Heavyweight Champion. Can he pull off the upset tonight and beat Damian Priest in the Judgment Day? Because Edge will not be happy. Rhea will not be happy. The Judgment Day is going to look weak. Damian Priest may be kicked out of the Judgment Day. Hmm. I wonder what Edge is going to think if Damian Priest loses. But here we go. Dolph with a snapmare to Damian Priest. And Ziggler's got all the offense so far. And now looking for a single leg. Boston Crab to the injured Damian Priest. And I say injured because this is going to break your back, possibly. That submission. Now Priest going to go for another backbreaker to Ziggler. Just raking that eye and back on his leg. God. Yeah, he's targeting that back, I see. And Priest going to go up. Looking to put an end to things early. Elbow! Connects! And Priest has got Ziggler where he wants him. Oh, my God. 
Christ, it's just not letting up. Oh my God! <laughs> Moonsault to Ziggler. Cover now. One. Oh, and a kick out. That was a really early kick out. Now, as of right now, the competitors for the Universal Championship match is Sami Zayn, Bobby Lashley, Jimmy Uso, Drew McIntyre, Roman Reigns, the Universal Champion himself. Remember, this is not a Universal Championship match. I may reword that, actually. They will get to challenge Roman Reigns. But is Roman doing what I think he's doing? And he's gonna win the chamber. Oh, he went for the super kick. And now Ziggler. Oh, dodgy Davia Priest and a takedown. But will Roman Reigns have the match in a submission now? Roman, will Roman Reigns have the match? Right after Elimination Chamber is finished, the structure. I don't know. I mean, the challenge is in that pod. But Drew may be the biggest threat in my opinion. And Jimmy. Famous by Ziggler as I'm talking about this here. And the WWE Championship Elimination Chamber match so far is only Brock. Which makes me think whoever's in that pod better be a threat. Because if Dolph wins tonight, like, I don't know. I'm not being mean, but Brock is bigger than him. But I'm not going to underestimate the underdog Dolph Ziggler, but nice. Rope breaks by Priest. That's very smart thinking. And now Ziggler gonna go up now for the elbow and it connects! But that's who we've got so far in the matches. Now Roman being in his match, it's just gonna make things a bit. People are gonna hate him. He's gonna get booed out the building if he won the match. He's just wasting stars. But, I mean, did you see Montez's performance on SmackDown? in that fatal four-way elimination match that was crazy montez took everybody out on his own i think he deserves to be in the elimination chamber we'll have to see what the general manager says later on tonight maybe i will actually request it god oh, sorry i've been talking over a bit of the match what a german suplex to Damian Priest and now into the announce table. Oh my God. We're at a six count. Get back in the ring, guys. Seven. If this ends in a count now, Edge isn't going to be happy either because Judgment Day still don't win a match. On Ziggler. Oh, got Priest here. And now over the ropes goes Damian Priest. And Ziggler is actually dominating. Damien Priest and God to that leg. He's throwing him over like two times now. Ziggler just wants to injure Priest and his back. That leg is probably hurt of Damien Priest and hit to the arm now. It's getting bad for Damien Priest. Oh, Edge was about to come and attack Dolph, but I think uh, Dolph was smart and threw Damien in the way. The Judgment Day are not going to be happy with Damian Priest right now. He's not doing great. Damian needs to get back into this match and win. That's what he needs to do. Not, not on the Judgment Day side, Dolph. And God! That's not smart. When the Judgment Day are on the outside, you do not want to be on that same side of the arena. Ring, sorry. And oh my... Oh, throwing him into Edge. Oh, but Edge... I think Edge is being smart. Because if he attacked Dolph, Damian would lose and Dolph would win by DQ. And oh my god, look at this man, like, Priest is dominating an edge, Edge was stalking his prey then, looks like Damien Priest, oh, oh, south of Haven, south of Haven, it connects, and that may be it for Dolph Ziggler, hooks the leg, will that be it, shooting the half, no, and a kick out, what a kick out by the show off Dolph Ziggler and now gonna go for that arm very smart move by Priest so he can't hit that zigzag and now going for that shoulder of Dolph Ziggler oh my god he is ruthlessly destroying Ziggler and a hit to the leg again he keeps targeting that leg and it's working look at this and Ziggler got a finisher in store will this be it for Priest 
Will it connect? It does! Priest is out cold. First finisher. One, two. Oh! Zerg Priest is so resilient. Priest is way too resilient. Kicking out of Ziggler's finisher there. Another super kick! Cover the Priest! One, two! The resilience! The resilience of Damian Priest! And Ziggler, third finisher in a row! And it connects! That's gotta be it! That's gotta be it! One, two, what? Priest is, Ziggler is in shock! Ziggler is in shock! Priest has kicked out of three finishers! And Ziggler again, looking to go up top! Splash misses! Went for a leg drop, doesn't realise Dolph is back up! And now going for the arm of Damien! Oh my god, a hit to Ziggler, big crossbody! Oh my god, Ziggler's in big trouble, wait a minute, Ziggler, Ziggler, jawbreaker to Damien! Dolph may just not go to a limited chip, but Damien's way too resilient. I don't even think he's going to win. I don't think Dolph's going to win. And now targets in the leg. Never mind, that is actually quite smart. I think he may win off this, because he's been targeting the leg the entire match. And look at Ziggler! He's so fired up tonight! What a debut for Universe Mode! Showing his power and agility for the Elimination Chamber. And now chops, punches, chops again. And now German suplex. Priest has been slammed down on his face. Priest is actually out cold this time. This is a long run up. God, it connects. Priest is out cold. Hug the leg, Ziggler. Will that be it? Surely. He's not that resilient too. And Ziggler gets the win over Damian Priest. Oh my god. Look at the judgment. Rhea is absolutely furious. Same with Edge. As Rhea leaves the, uh, the arena walking up the ramp right now. Up to the Titan Tron area. Ziggler's absolutely amazed how he got that win. And he should be because this is... Wait! Edge! Spear! Wait! No! No! Edge can't do this! He's that mad that he's just attacking Ziggler for no damn reason! Just because Damien Priest lost the match! Oh, this is so uncalled for! Edge is absolutely ruthless! Is Edge doing this so he sends a message to the general manager to get a match in the WWE title match? Oh my god! Oh my god! Edge is absolutely fuming. This is so uncalled for, Edge. Edge, what are you doing? Ziggler's going to lose his spot at the Elimination Chamber. He's going to be too injured to compete. God. And Edge now leaving the arena. This is so uncalled for. Oh, I don't think Edge is done. And now the headbutts. He's going to try and make Dolph bleed. Shed blood. Oh my god, what is he doing? And again, he's not even done. He went in for more. Oh my god. Right, let's cut the freaking camera. Dolph is absolutely bleeding out of his head. Like, oh my god. Let's get into the next match. Alright, I, I don't know how we're going to come back from that. But we've got a... Oh, how am I going to come back from that? A 10-man gauntlet match to determine who's the next person in the Elimination Chamber match. And we're going to get two picks without qualifying. So this is going to be three picks, sorry, without qualifying. What just happened? What just happened? Oh my God. Edge is bloody ruthless. Wait. Wait, what? Wait. Okay, so Edge just tweeted. Like, just as he left. Say hello to the general manager. He's wiped out on the floor. Thanks for the match, bitch. Are you serious? Edge attacked? 
the general manager? But what does he mean by match? Is he in the WWE title match? Or is he in like a regular... I don't know. We may have to find out at Elimination Chamber. But anyway, here is Seth freaking Rollins. And he looks ready for whoever his opponent is in the first half. The and oh no! Tommaso Shamba. This man dominates NXT. Every roster he's been on. It is time for dominance. Rollins is in the match. Who could be in this match? We, we could have some surprises. We could have just the regular roster stars, but still, it's going to be a big night for everybody. What if, and this is a what if, what if, <laughs> like genuinely, what if the Judgment Day interfered in this match? It could happen. It could happen. But Edge got his match, so I doubt he's in this one. Because he literally got his match. I don't know what he means by that. But he must have got his title match at Elimination Chamber. So congrats, Edge. You attacked the general manager without fear. And you've got the damn match. What a piece of shit. Like, I support the bad guy, but that was just uncalled for. Like, Dolph Ziggler earned that and he's only just debuted in universe mode and he's injured and defeated the wwe not wwe champion he defeated damian priest one of his members that's it he was probably planning on kicking damian priest out of the team anyway but anyway let's get into this match forget all that we're now in for this gauntlet match slash royal rumble style match so anybody can come in but turn the interval up oh my god no 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 already curb stomp are you kidding me chomper has just got in this damn match and he's already about to eliminate him this is too fast oh my god chomper chomper's staying in it chomper's staying in it Oh my god, he's still in it! Big elbow! And it connects good. Oh, Seth Rollins, Seth Rollins! Super kick! And Chomper's out of the ring. Seth just dominated Chomper. Who is next in this gauntlet match? Oh, the man that defeated Drew McIntyre almost, but he got the knees up, which sucks. But anyway, Montez in the ring. Can he do it? Is he going to Elevation Chamber? Oh, my God. Seth's not cool. Chance from the crowd went for a super kick. Can't connect with it. But it connects that time. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Super kick. Oh, my God. Rollins nearly got out. Rollins nearly got out, but he stays in it. Montez is showing the most fight already in this match. And oh no, Montez got caught. Curb stomp. Seth may hold, hold, hold this match hostage. Oh God, Montez on the ropes. Close line. Wow. We're up to the third person already. Second person, sorry. Who is next? Oh no, we are on the third. Oh my god. The debut. The debut. The de Seth, turn the hell around. Oh god. Oh god. Braun Strowman. Look at the power. Oh, if he wins this, I think the Elimination Chamber's been done for. Roman may lose his title. And now punch him, Braun. Doesn't do anything. And oh god, look at the power of the monster among men! And now a choke slam! And stepping on Rollins. Rollins, Rollins catches the leg! Oh god, oh no, he's got, he's got, he could eliminate him right now. Oh, Rollins is way too strong. 
Yeah, Braun is way too strong. Oh, God. DDT! Braun's down! Braun's getting right back up, though. Oh, no. Oh, no. To the back of the neck! Ah! Oh, oh, no. Oh, God. Braun Strowman. He's too big for Seth Rollins. And now Rollins! Holy shit! Military pressed out of the ring, and oh no, who will actually eliminate this man? He's too big. He's too big to be eliminated. Who could it be? Oh. Oh! Oh no! Never mind! It's Killer Cross! Oh my god, carrying Cross. No, 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 no. He's about to be eliminated immediately. No punch! Punch to Braun. Will this be it? For Braun Strowman gets a headbutt in. Wait a minute. Cross jacket! Oh my god! Oh my god! He's gonna pass out Strowman! He's gonna pass out Strowman! Strowman's gonna be out this match in no time! He's gonna pass him out! He's gonna pass him out! Oh my god! Oh my god! Is Strowman gonna make it out? And he does. Wait, he doesn't make it out. I think he released it. Oh, taking some Roman strategies from before. Now stomping on the hand of Strowman. If Cross wins, that will be big. Roman versus Cross, sign me up. That is a big match. Or even Edge. Because this is for the WWE title match. I was just thinking Roman versus Cross would be an amazing match. But yeah, this is uh, for the WWE title that Edge is holding right now. And oh my god, Braun Strowman! Remember, if the general manager didn't like what he did, well, he obviously he didn't, because he punched the hell out of him, and what a chop. But yeah, he punched the hell out of him. Could he strip Edge of his WWE title? I mean, that's a possibility, but the general manager is now injured and will be out for a long-ass time, a.k.a. Christian. So he's going to be out for a long time. And now a big chop to cross. And oh my god, throws cross! Well, yeah. <laughs> cross, you tried, but it, it was too much for you, bro. Braun's too strong. Oh my god, and Cross has just been thrown out. Should I even be commentating? Braun's just gonna win the whole thing. Who is next for the demise of Braun Strowman? Who's it gonna be? Oh! 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 Very strong man here, but. Strowman. Okay. <laughs> uh, Dragonov, uh, maybe a trouble. Oh god! Oh god! Can Dragonov get into this match? Oh god! Oh! Dragonov! Get some offense in on Strowman! Oh my god, could Dragonov do it? Yeah, he's not gonna do it. Yep, uh, Strowman just instantly get him in the corner, and oh my god, is he about to chuck him out immediately? Without a finisher? Oh my god, he did. Are you actually... Braun is just mocking opponents at this point! Strowman! Monta showed the most fight in my opinion so far. Because Strowman doesn't count, he's just... A Ricochet. I don't know. Ricochet in the ring now. Braun Strowman got Ricochet up already and slammed down. Ricochet is already getting brutalized by the monster among men. Wait a minute! Ray Kyle! Ray Kyle! Oh my god! Oh my god! Strowman's out! Strowman's down and out! Strowman is down and out! And Connor, he's busting open Strowman! Up goes Ricochet! Six thirty! Is he about to eliminate Strowman? There's no way. There's no way that look at look at Ricochet. Look at Ricochet taking the fight. Ricochet's put the most fight up to the monster. Oh my God, Ricochet! Ricochet's gonna try and push him out, but he's too heavy. He's too heavy. He's too heavy. And Strowman. It's just not going out like this. Oh my god. Shoves Ricochet. Oh no. 
He tried. Oh my god, he went for it. And Ricochet's out. Well, Ricochet, you tried. Yep, up he goes. Running power slam. Oh my god, the most fight we've seen all night as well yeah, from this man. This Could Ricochet challenge. automatically so, get in the Elimination Chamber after this? I mean, look, he put up the most fights as Strowman! God! What a fall! He put up the most fights as Strowman. He literally busted the man open. Recoil, 6.30. I thought that was it. I thought Strowman was gone. But no. And wait a minute. Is that Jimmy? Roman Reigns. May not be happy about this one. But Braun instantly catches Jimmy in a butterfly suplex. And oh my god, the ground and pound starts. Jesus. Jimmy, I think, was the... Pr well then. Well then, Jimmy. Run him, power slam. Oh my god. Yep, lifts him up again. Oh my god, and just slams him down! Jimmy's looking helpless to every attack, finding out exactly um, what it means to get these hands. And Jimmy able to big elbow to, to the side of the head and a big headbutt. Um, is Jimmy about to win, beat Braun Strowman? Is he about to do it? And now Chops, kick, no, no, no! Sorry, back kick! Strowman's out! What? No, no, Jimmy is not winning. Imagine this, title versus title. Jimmy wins the WWE Championship and faces Roman, title versus title. Oh my God, could it happen? John Morrison is in the ring now versus Jimmy Uso. Oh my god, John Morrison lifts up Jimmy. Oh, gets the elbows in on Morrison. Big hit to the head. Flapjack! God, what a connection. Breaking the fourth wall, let me have a drink. Right, stomp to the head of John Morrison. God! Oh my god, oh my god! So splash! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Uso's about to do it. Jimmy Uso is about to defeat John Morrison. Look at Jimmy laying the combinations. John jumps over and now looking for a wrestling takedown to Jimmy. But Jimmy is. Getting caught with everything. Chops, punches, kick. No. Grabs Jimmy. Into the corner. Oh, Jimmy. Jimmy. Jimmy could get eliminated very quickly here. Very, very quickly indeed. Oh my God. Lifted him up but an elbow to John Morrison's head there. And oh. Tornado DDT. Maybe the proven Roman Reigns thing isn't going to work out for Jimmy Uso. I'm looking for that. I forgot what it's called, but an elbow drop! I think it's a 450 elbow drop. Yes, I got that correct. I know I did. And now into the corner. I think Jimmy could be done here. Lifting up here. Going out of the ring. Can he do it? Jimmy's still in this thing. Yeah, Jimmy is... Actually being resilient? Maybe Roman... Should be on the lookout for Jimmy Uso's resilience as well, because remember, Roman wants that match on SmackDown with Jimmy. But what if Triple H actually beats Roman Reigns for the Universal Championship? Jimmy's just gonna laugh at Roman. Huh, I know you didn't beat me, but you haven't got your championships anymore. Like. Is Roman gonna get a new tribal chief? Are we gonna have a new bloodline if Roman loses? Is Roman not gonna be the leader? Who knows what's gonna happen with the bloodline after this, but we'll just have to wait and see. And now John Morrison takes down Jimmy Uso as we move into our next person entering the match. Who is it? 
What? Why? What is he doing here? It's Edge! No, no, not like this. Super kick to Morrison. Looking for a spear. It can no! DDT, gets caught in the DDT. Oh my God, Morrison can actually pull off an upset here. Not an upset, I actually want to win because I don't want to see freaking Edge win this match. And a 450 elbow! Edge lost to Roman. Will he get his match? This is what he meant. I got the match. Thanks, general manager. What in the he No. You don't think. Oh my god. Oh my god. You know why Christian hasn't stripped him from the title. We know why he's not been removed from the match. We know why he's not been fired. They are friends. Christian and Edge, if you remember, are long-time co-workers. Do you think Christian felt that bad that he just couldn't take Edge from the match? And Edge has not had one championship in the modern era? Whoa. I think that is what's happened. And look who it, who look who's in. Edge is in the match. If he wins, I don't know what's gonna happen. We're gonna ha if he wins that championship match at the Elimination Chamber. Who knows what's gonna go down? Who's gonna be his next challenger? Oh, man, I don't know. Have to wait and see. And now Edge. Look at them stalking each. They are going ham on each other tonight. The rated R superstar Edge, John Morrison. Let's just talk about John Morrison for one second, because we haven't. This man is a talent. He is athletic. He can literally. Did you see that elbow drop? He hit that from miles. Come on, hits the back. And I don't know, he's just, I see John winning. I don't know why. And now a Northern Lights. That's John Morrison's athleticism for you. And John Morrison, John Morrison, John Morrison could do it. John Morrison could do the unthinkable. And now Edge gets caught in the gut. And now Morrison gets Edge. Oh my God, on the ropes. Oh, he was about to get eliminated. Oh, but Edge, Edge got the offense now. Bang! Oh my God. Edge may have knocked out Morrison. Oh my God, Jesus! Yeah, Morrison's, is he got a concussion? Morrison's out cold. Are you kidding me? Morrison's not moving. Morrison's not moving. Are you kidding me? is going to Elimination Chamber! What just happened? We'll see you at Elimination Chamber! What a pay-per-view to look forward to!